Did you know that Rolls-Royce has a policy that says we all have the responsibility to operate sustainably? Let's get to it. Hello, I'm Laura Groom with Health, Safety, Environmental here at Rolls-Royce. I replaced the retiring Praveen Patel this last October and work with the Indianapolis facilities on environmental compliance and also work with recycling, waste, and sustainability. Today, we are going to talk to David Kripe from Heritage and talk a little bit about waste and recycling and how you can help. I'm here today with David Kripe from Heritage Environmental. Hello, David. Would you like to tell us what it is that you do here at Rolls-Royce? Uh, this month, I would like to talk about increasing our recycling efforts through non-production waste commonly found on your line sign, trash and recycling, and also your break rooms. Did you know that during the ISO audit that we had in 2021, there was an NCR violation issued for items that could have been recycled and were found in the trash can? I did, yeah. Okay. Can you help us identify some opportunities to make a better outcome next year? I'd be happy to do that. Uh, so first we're going to start by redistributing uh, pamphlets to all departments to help uh, in this effort. Uh, if they have questions about uh, whether or not it's recycling, most dual trash and recycling receptacles have images on them to help make it easier uh, when you're in the middle of your day. Uh, common things that you might see on uh, the plant floor or that you might bring to uh, the plant are uh, plastic grocery bags, greasy food containers, and styrofoam. Those are all not recyclable and should be placed in the trash. Uh, currently we're sitting at 56% recycling. Uh, over 90% of the common materials that you'd find that are not related to production uh, can be recycled. And we're hoping to meet that goal of recycling and decreasing our solid waste. That's really a lot of items that can be recycled. So it sounds like what you've just told me is basically everything that we generate throughout the course of the workday that's not production related can be thrown in the recycling bin and not the trash. Most all of it, yes. Okay. So greasy food containers, grocery, plastic grocery bags, styrofoam, and there was one other thing that you mentioned that we can't throw in the recycling bin. Batteries. Batteries, okay. David and I both sit here in the Victory Building Training Center. If you would like to reach out to either of us to ask a question, feel free to uh, reach us on email or you can uh, drop by the um, old library and the training center or ask your supervisor for our contact information. So um, David, thank you so much for uh, sharing this information with us today. Um, in 2022, your support is vital to ensure that we're not issued another NCR violation. And if there's any questions that you have um, regarding recyclable materials, please reach out to either myself or David Kripe with Heritage. We both sit in the same office here in the Victory Training Center, and we would be happy to work with you to make sure that you uh, understand what can be recycled and what cannot. And Thank you so much for your time. Have a good day. Thank you. Thanks.